Right now, police are still surrounding the street in Aliquippa. In Aliquippa, when the mills went down, everything went. No jobs in Aliquippa. You gotta go out of Aliquippa to find a job. We're a praying family, so God is gonna get us through this. Children who are without their mother, a family ripped apart. It's hard. You gotta really be dedicated to really make it out of Aliquippa. That's what I was saying. If you don't have that drive, you know, to, to take you somewhere, then that's where you'll end up at. It's either football or you got a 4.0 or you don't, it's hard to go anywhere from here. Like, it's hard. My name is Joseph Percival, and Aliquippa means everything to me. The good, the bad, and the ugly it makes you who you are. So, this is where I grew up. Like everybody lived here, because it was so big, you know what I mean? What kids come from here, you know what I mean? They, they come from stuff like this. They come from stuff like this. And see, Aliquippa can make you or break you. And um, some, some kids make it, some kids get caught in a trap. You know what I mean? So it ain't like we grow up with all the best stuff, the best cars, always have a meal, warm house. A lot of kids don't grow up like that here. So coming from where they come from and make it to where they are, that's a story in itself. It's Aliquippa is one big family. You know what I mean? Everybody knows everybody, so everybody helps everybody. Uh, Cause you want to see your community come back, so you help out as much as you can. We helped a few kids out. Just say, father isn't in their life or father might have died. So they look towards the coaching staff, you know, any type of positive male role model, you know what I mean? And we have a really good coaching staff. You know, it's, it's just, it's more, it's more than football. This is the pit. This was chosen as the number one place to watch a high school football game in Pennsylvania. Because when you, as you're looking, everywhere you look, it's over a hillside. It's down, and you, this is the only way into the stadium is up from up there to, to get down here. So it's uh, the pit. Hey, Booty, can I get some love? Ha ha ha. Three, one, two, 
which I like playing football here. Mm-hmm. Very intense, hard. It's like actually like college almost. Like the stuff we do at practice when I'm on the phone with coaches, and I told them about it, they'd be like, "We don't even do that here." Like the much how much running we do and stuff. We watch a lot of film. Um, our practices are our intense. Monday, I mean Tuesday, Wednesday, Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Um, Coach Z, he likes everything to be perfect. So that's what we can't mess up. Everything got to be perfect. The college, getting out, and each game, and each game, that's what I'm playing for a scholarship and my family, making them proud because I like the game. But that scholarship, that's, that's, that's one of the biggest things. Just the way it is, they believe that this is what to work for. And they've seen so many other guys get, get a chance to, to be a productive citizen through this. You know, I'm more proud of the kids that go on to be teachers or shop owners or whatever they are because of, of football. It teaches, football is the ultimate game. I mean, it's, it teaches you everything you should know. Uh, you know all the trite things, the camaraderie and discipline and responsibility and all that kind of stuff but it, it does it does and it become better people for it do they all make it no yeah, that's not that's not reasonable that they're all going to be good people and not go to jail some of them I mean from uh, the last state championship team in 2003 seven kids from that team are dead you know it's a violent world out there Can't wait. I can't wait. <laughs> it's my senior year. I've been living my whole life, and this is everything that I wanted to come true is just happening. And geez, we just got one. Blow them out tomorrow. Get it out the way early. So, but yeah, the whole team in sight. I mean, Every game, we, we treat it like it's the biggest game. So if we playing the sorry team in the league, we're going to treat them like we playing the Steelers. So. I mean, because a lot of players in the, from the past, from our couple who was really good, went to Pitt. Mm-hmm. But surprisingly, surprisingly, our three top recruits last year, none of them went to Pitt. So, and, I mean, I don't know. Is there some truth? A lot of people ask me that, but I honestly don't think about college for real. Uh, I don't about high school football. Yep. It's a camera. <laughs> 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 Marlo, chill. Sit. Sit. Hey. Bo! Bo! He done turn off the light bulb. Come on, get up. Let's go. Let's go. Time to go. How are you feeling? Good. You ready for the big game? Can't wait. Nice. I'm 
in the name of Jesus, we thank you, Father God, for allowing us to see another day, Lord. I ask of you today, Father God, as Arrington and the rest of his teammates get out and go play this thing called football, Lord Jesus, that you protect them, Lord Jesus. Protect them from injury, Father God, even protect the, the opponents, Lord Jesus. We ask you in your name. Amen. Do you fine. Did y'all see the big picture of downstairs? Where your lead set? You know what I'm at? Uh, this is what it consists on Friday. Nothing but football, 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 and I love it. Come on. <laughs> mercy we don't we got to pour it on right now it's ball or body ball or body body on four on three one two three body. Barton, Barton, watch the back swinging this way there it is. 
We ain't adjusting out of it very well. You know what I mean? First step. Step on the glitch at the 11. Oh, yeah. Move, I wanted your head, cuz, yes. I look at you, I'm like, I can't <laughs> No, bro, that fumble, dude. Pick it up. No, that fumble. I almost picked it up. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. Yes, bro. And then Riggins fell on my leg and I dropped Why it. Why pick up a fumble? Thanks. While they're playing here, they owe us everything. So we feed them, we clothe them, we keep them out of trouble. And then when they're done playing here, I owe them everything. There's never a time you can't call. Never a time you can't ask for a favor. I want them to be lawyers, doctors, teachers, whatever they want to be. It's important to understand just a part of something. We try to make them feel an important part of it.